destruction of Supreme Court as Asai Dukubo enters Abuja with Niger Delta youth begin demolition until Tunubu is sworn in. Hmm. My people, my people. Asari Dokubo. Dokubo, Dokubo. Well, I would say that Dokubo is taking, um, taking a move that he cannot be able to finish. You understand? He's taking a move that he cannot be able to finish. Um, well, uh, one thing I will say on in this is that uh, no matter how the Kubo tries, the truth of the matter here is that what the court decides is what they decide. Nobody can 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 undecide what the court has already decided. So the Kubo may be thinking that maybe uh, his, his action in Abuja will make the court to, you know, to wind up, wind back whatever they have decided. Well, um, be that as it may, of a truth, Tunubu is already making the wave and also is already making the getting the credits, and the um, Supreme Court is already winding up to make their verdict so i see no reason why the kubo will be drinking um, water in another man's bottle when it is not his own bottle you get it and that is just it. well my people when i don't see as they happen now the kubo start this very one who abuja don't face this very serious destruction as the kubo enter the environment with ninja delta use let's check the content my dear listeners this is evening news. The fact that Asiwaju Bola Ahmed Tunubu's election victory is currently being contested in Abuja before the presidential election petition tribunal is no longer breaking news. You may recall that Mr. Peter Obi and his PDP counterpart Atiku Abubakar are both asking the tribunal to overturn the declaration that Asiwaju Bola won the election. The two petitioners are asserting victory in an election that many people consider to have been contentious recently. Additionally, it should be recalled that there was a non-violent protest in front of of the Abuja Appeal Court. Many civil society organizations have come to protest and put pressure on the judges to act morally. In the meantime, just yesterday, a video from the scene showed some protesters who were reportedly brought in by Asari Dukubo, the former president of the Ejo Youth Council of Nigeria. The young People might be chanting loudly in support of the coming president. Festus Kiyamu, a former spokesman for the All Progressive Congress Presidential Campaign Council, shared the video. Grand Force, metamorphically speaking, from the Greeks organized by my longtime brother and friend Mujahid Asai Okubo in support of swearing in of officially Bola Ahmed Tunubu. Following the crisis that has so far ravaged the party, aside Okubo, a former Niger Delta militant has taken on the Labour Party. He has claimed that their party chairman was beaten up and that a senior advocate of Nigerian son was harassed today at court. Aside Okubo is looking for favor. That is just it. QED. Is looking for favor. Is looking for position. That is just the truth. All this that is putting up, all this you know, demonstration is putting up, is for the purpose of looking for favor. He wants to be favored. He wants to be able to favor him. What is the need of taking dogs? Dogs to. Uh, 
to, to Abuja. He want Tribu to turn him to um, Solomo. <laughs> hey, my people, some people with many, many uh, talks. Anyhow, uh, my people, I tell them, I say, uh, uh, no matter how the Kupo still try to um, to prove Jagaban in uh, in Abuja, the court will still um, give the verdict they want to give. He's just drinking Panadol in another man's problem. You understand? And I just it. Let's quickly get your opinion on the matter and let's know what you think. What's your own take and what's your own opinion on all of this? Maybe. Don't forget to leave them below the comment section. Click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated each time we upload any new videos. Thank you.